what's up everybody welcome back to our channel i'm kim and i'm Cass, and we got a new video for y'all so <laughs> we're trying to do a mukbang today so we got some food here and we order from a place called Spuds. It's near our school. Most of our followers go to Cal, so y'all know what we talk about. Um, they have different flavored fries, burgers, chicken, pretty much, I don't know, anything they always have. So let me show y'all what I got. I got loaded fries. <laughs> it has cheese, bacon, and ranch on it with chives on top and then i also got and that's all that comes on that yeah mm -hmm. and then over here y'all couldn't see it i got some mango habanero wings with ranch on the side what'd you get i got buffalo chicken fries but i didn't get chicken because no <laughs> last time we got chicken they put like a whole chicken in it so i just got buffalo sauce and mozzarella cheese and then i got what are these called? Chicken, chicken fingers? Chicken fingers. I got chicken fingers because I didn't get the chicken in here. I figured it'd be good on the side or whatever. And then I got water. And then in here I got Coke because, I don't know, I got to drink oh. Coke. It's probably going to be better with both. In this cup, I have white cranberry strawberry juice. So, that's what we got on the menu today. So, we're going to start eating. And we'll just talk. But no, um... She wasn't here. Who? You. Then you ain't let me say the story. She was a hell and I wasn't. No. <laughs> she wasn't here when I was a freshman. Oh. <sighs> Spud was way better. Like, if y'all go to Cal, y'all know that. What year was it? In like 2014, 2015, before Spud's got their remodel in the store, they used to be fire. They had everything. You can create your own fries. You can get waffle fries, straight fries, curly fries, anything. Now they changed up and their food ain't as good as it used to be so that's kind of a disappointment I'm hoping the chicken's gonna be good let me drink this first i don't know which one i want to drink first mm. i'm thirsty good see i usually get the chicken bacon ranch fries but lately they're chicken like i said with these they gave us the whole chicken. It, it was, tastes like they're taking it straight from a rotisserie chicken and just putting it in there. I don't know what they've been doing. So, I had to get something with less meat in it. And they just use, like, little pieces of bacon. So, this is good. I'm going to take this bite. It's kind of big. Oh, we got, like, this see. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. with ranch and fire so we figured today we would talk about our opinions on making a couples channel a youtube couple channel because like people doing it yeah we watch youtube a lot and a lot a lot we usually watch couples like we watch um gold juice we were watching Dama and christy uh, we used to watch Chris and Queen. We watched DK4L, Damien and Bianca, all those couples. And it just seems like all these couples are just falling apart now. Like, I don't know. Would you start? You think you, well, you talk to somebody, but Ooh, would you actually start? Dang. <laughs> <laughs> what? Would you actually start a channel um, with whoever you would talk to? Like, if y'all start dating? Probably not. Why? Because I feel like. Uh -huh. I'm not saying it's not gonna last, but I feel like if it don't, then it's like y'all both built the platform together. Mm -hmm. Y'all both got the money together. So it's like if y'all separate, I don't know. I just feel like it's probably not worth it. Not saying I wouldn't. I'd probably feature him on my channel, like right. have him in my channel, but not make her own. Y'all never had habanero. Uh, what is this? I don't know. Mango habanero wings. I never had them, so I'm about to try them now. Dip it in some ranch because I always need my ranch. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why you get it? If you never had it, what if you don't like it? Mm. Mm. Guess that's not a problem. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I've seen people eating it on YouTube, and I wanted to try it. Mm, good. So, would you? I don't know. These are spicy, though. Whew. I can't do spice. Like, ugh, this is hot. Um, I think DK4L, they're doing it the right way. I never see them, like, yeah, they are. If they do get in an argument, you would never know because they never post about each other on there. They always post positive things. All their mm -hmm. videos are positive. Like, it to me, it doesn't seem like they just post stuff just to post it. Like, some people, you could tell, they post fake pranks just to post fake pranks. Like, mm -hmm. um, So Illuminati and... I don't know who that is. I mean, I know, but I, I never watched them. Uh, so. so Illuminati and OMG Yo Ash, I feel like sometimes their, fake, their pranks are fake. Their what? Their pranks are fake. <laughs> sometimes, yeah, I feel like theirs are fake sometimes. I don't know. But DK4L, they always got some interesting content. And they always seem like they are genuinely having fun while they do it. I'm trying to think of what other couples are out there. Mm. I don't know. I like Gold Juice. Gold Juice is cool, too. Mm -hmm. I like watching them. I like Damien and Bianca. I don't care. I love them. People don't like them, but well, I know people don't. But I did. Because at one point, they was posting. When they were arguing stuff, they, they would broke post up. on there. Yeah, they would actually post that. Now, I didn't like how they would post, like, when they broke up and stuff. But BJ and Kyrie are so cute. Mm -hmm. And, like, but even Kelly Sweet. Her and her boyfriend had a whole channel, and they broke up. I ain't like Kelly Sweet. Me either. <laughs> That's just my. I don't either. This is off topic, but to me, she shouldn't have got them boobs like that. Her boobs is too big for her body. Mm -mm. If y'all know who we're talking about, Kelly Sweet is this YouTuber. She's super skinny. Like, super skinny. I don't even know how much she weighs. Probably like 100 pounds. But she got her boobs done. And she got like a D? Was it a D? Did she? Mm -hmm. They look like it. They look on huge her. on her. And yeah, she should have got like a C. Like, she you know, was having average. problems. And had to get them redone or something. And still got them big. Even though the doctor said not to do that. I hate when people do that. The doctor knows what's best. They went to school. They got their education. So they're telling you. Mm -hmm. If they tell you not to go that big, don't go that big. Sorry, I just went on a ramp. I no, they are big that. though. If y'all don't know who we talking about, y'all gotta look her up and go look. And I think another thing is. We can't insert a picture. Kelly Sweet and her boyfriend wasn't together that long before they made the channel. No, they weren't. I think you have to be with that person for a while. Because within like a first year, that's when mm -mm, you're still really getting to know someone. Mm -hmm. You're going to go make a channel, y'all probably going to break up. Yeah, I think they should have waited too. For sure. Now, Domo and Chrissy... Oh yeah, we gotta talk about them. I always knew they were gonna break up, okay? Before they even had Dominic, I I don't know. They wasn't even dating that long before they even had Dominic and did all that. But after they had Dominic, I was like, oh, everything's going good. Like, they was uploading all the time, never heard about them arguing or nothing. And then they broke up. Not even gonna lie, I was kind of upset that they broke up. Well, not upset, but like, I was torn because I really liked them. She I was upset. <laughs> <laughs> well, I like Domo and Chrissy, so. And then Domo said she was upset and then tried to expose Chrissy low key, and I didn't know who to believe. I don't know. Basically, they broke up. <laughs> Basically, yeah. they broke up, but they were still living in the same house. And Chrissy moved on. I guess got somebody else. Dama wasn't hurt until she actually moved on. Because she probably didn't think she was going to move on that fast. So then, like, after that, Dama will start posting all these videos on YouTube. Like, how I really feel. And basically telling us how she really felt about Chrissy. And she was hurt. Even though they agreed to break up, she was still upset about it. Like, really upset. I don't know if the video is still up, but if it is, y'all should go watch it. I don't know, because I guess Chrissy told Dama, like, <coughs> I don't want you to post my business. And Dama oh, did yeah. it anyways. Mm-hmm. Because she was hurt, which I can understand, but at the same time, Chrissy's entitled to move on if she wants to. Mm -hmm. But Chrissy did kind of move fast and is posting her girlfriend. Like, she don't even care. Like, she posts her on her um, Snapchat and everything. 
if I was Dama, I'd still be hurt because I would too because she did move kind of fast. And like, Dama did say they just broke up. Chrissy has all that money because she was with Dama. So Chrissy would have, I guess Chrissy went on vacation with her new girlfriend. She was saying she wouldn't even have that money going on vacation if it wasn't for Dama. I low key be sick. I ain't gonna lie. I would be too. It's weird. So. Oh, and then another couple, Kaylin and Kyra. Oh, yes. What is up with them? If y'all watch them, y'all know. If y'all don't know who Kaylin and Kyra is, they're a couple, but they're like a different kind of couple because they're always saying like they're Christians. They have this strong religion. Like they really follow their religion, I guess. So they got married first, then had a baby. And I guess that's what they want to do. They got married young, but mm -hmm, they're young. Now their mom is coming out saying all that stuff, like saying Kaylin is abusive to her and he's a man of the house and don't let Kyra speak for herself and stuff. What else was they saying? Who, them or the mom? The mom. Um, I think that might have been it. Her main point was that he abuses Kyra physically. Yo, you scared me. Sorry, y'all, that's Marvin. Mm -hmm. Trying to make an appearance in our video. You feel me? <laughs> I ain't staying long because it's still a game on. So I'm going to catch y'all later. Hey, you got a paper to write too, so. 15 pages. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but basically, if y'all watch them, Kyra seems like this really sweet, quiet girl. And Kaylin, I don't I never really got a bad vibe from him, but now that Kyra's mom came out and said that, I could kinda low key see him being controlling. Y'all should if y'all yeah, watch them, the video. Yeah. See. If y'all watch them, you should comment below if you think that because I feel like I've been eating these for so long and I haven't made a dent yet. Well, we've been talking a lot. We're going to take a break and talk and we just going we just going to eat real quick because I'm trying to eat. We take a break right now? And talking? No, I've been eating. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm talking about, though. Mm -hmm. So we're eating now. I'm, I'm eating now. I see. You've been eating the whole time. Barely. I was talking. You know I usually eat faster than that. Well, that was rude. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Do y'all watch Be Love's Life or hmm. Oh, Eat with Q? Be Love. See, I like Eat with Q, but she be burping too much for me. Is it that one girl? More one girl, cause that makes that announcement in the beginning of her videos. <laughs> She'd be like, hi guys, if you're new to my channel, just know that I do eat, smack and moan. No, she'd be like, burp, smack and moan or something like that. So if you don't like it, you can click off and I'll still be watching. But then I get mad when she burp. Yeah. When I click off. Because I watched her one video. I ain't like it. I was she mad. She burp like the way she burps is obnoxious. She'll go. Uh, or something. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> She'll go something. She do something extra. I like B-Love's life. She's extra too. She's no, I like her. She smacks, but I don't care. She be smack. Ooh. Yo, I'm real picky with my food, so. I just dropped a piece of fry. Let me just set that right there. But, um. Don't say nothing about me. She's like the queen of seafood boils. She can make not look and good. Like, mm-hmm. Looks so good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. -hmm. mm. So, whose YouTube channel do you watch the most? Me? Uh-huh. Oh, mm. I'm gonna look at my phone real quick because there's a lot. It might be Damien and Bianca. I need to start watching them. Wait, can you like categorize it? Categorize mm -hmm. it? So, for who? Who do you go for, to for my mom? Mm. Hold on, I know who. You gotta get the name. Probably Sass ASMR. No, it ain't her, but. Or Eat With Kimchi or something. No, not that either. Oh. I thought you knew it. Oh, her. I just said that, Sass ASMR. Oh. <laughs> yes, her. I'm gonna show y'all. 
that's the name. Oh God. You can't really see, but her. I watch her the most. Who you watch, Be Love? I've been rocking with Be Love since the beginning. Not the very beginning, beginning, but close to the beginning. I love her and her whole family. I watch her too, though. I'm not, not saying I don't, but like I watch her. And I like seafood, too, so I like to watch her eat seafood. Besides mussels, I don't eat mussels, but I want to try her <clears throat> sauce. That's one of the things I want to do is try her sauce. Be loves smack delicious seafood sauce. Who do you watch so much for beauty? Makeup? I like to watch Aaliyah J. But I feel like she's not posting that many just straight. Really watch her. Who do you watch? I don't really watch Beauty. I don't watch Beauty that much either. Me either. So if I watch Beauty, but when it pops up, it's usually Lisette or Jasmine. Yeah. For me, I you I probably watch what's that more? I don't know. Hmm. Now that we, now that I'm thinking about that, I'm thinking about Kennedy, and that's making me think about DDG and when they dated. Oh yeah, because they broke up too. Damn. But <laughs> I low key think they're gonna get back together. Cause they've, they've been, been hanging out. They've been hanging out in Lincoln. Mm -hmm. I think they're gonna get back to you know DDG. Mm -hmm. He like clickbaiting and being extra, so he probably gonna be like me asking Chris. Kennedy out. No. What y'all think about, about Chris Queen? And oh, yeah, yeah, Chris. The whole situation. Clarence. <laughs> There's just so many uh, couples. Like I don't know. It's just starting to get sloppy. Like so dr We like, gotta talk about them. Drama field. That's what Wait. it is. So should who we you? start with name? Broke up. How we feel about when they broke up and took Chris her and going to Clarence. Yeah, and let's start from the beginning. Alright. We liked Chris and Queen. Yeah. Like, I was always watching. Just like I do d &B Nation. I never watch. had a bad vibe from either of them. Me either. I never had a bad vibe from Chris. Me either. I thought Queen was goofy. I thought they was a goofy couple. Mm. CJ's cute. But how did you feel when they broke up? Did you see it coming? Mm-hmm. I've seen it coming because, okay. Wait, remember when they first, they first broke up because he cheated with the girl at the club or whatever it happened? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And they made that video sitting and it was like an interview. Mm -hmm. Why'd they break up after that? He cheated again? You remember? I think. I feel like he did cheat again and she okay. was done. Well, that's why. But nobody knew the second time. She said, in the video where they were sitting across from each other and it was like an interview, somebody asked, I think Chris, like, would you cheat again? And he was like, I can't promise that. Like, I'm a man. So I just knew, like, he's been cheating already. And he can't even tell her he's not about to cheat again. I just knew it was like, not saying they were going to end quick, but I just knew they weren't going to last. <laughs> what about you? Did you know they were going to break up? The first time, she should have left them. Mm -hmm. After them girls came out. And admitted all that, so she should have left him right then and there. Yeah, because even when the girls came out, Queen even admitted, this ain't the first time I heard he was cheating, so he was already cheating before that. I know they're married, but... Mm-mm. What -mm. She should have left. Yeah. So after the second time, I was happy that she left. Wait, because then... Okay, so then when they broke up, you think she was talking to Clarence already? Yeah, I do. Why they were together? Or, like, when they was on bad terms. She even said, like, Clarence was always her Instagram crush. That's what I'm saying, Even when they was though. together. So, so, I feel like... Do you think they were talking, like, the first time he cheated, like, with the girls? Or do you think it was after that? Like, how I long do you know. think they was talking for? I don't know. But I think if they was talking, she's probably going to say they were just talking as friends. Like, she didn't yeah. know that they was going to be together. She was just talking to him just to talk. I think so, too. And with Parker, I don't know if... She was just always... Chris early. only dated her because she was, like, you know, famous... Or if he dated her because he actually liked her because he's iffy. I don't know about him. What you think? Mm, you think he I dated her because he liked her? Or because she probably... I'll well, never like, watch well their relationship. Probably just a date or just a date. I think so too. Because, um, that relationship was just... I didn't feel the vibe. Mm-mm. Hmm? And I stopped watching him. How do you feel about her being pregnant? Queen. Mm. I'm gonna say this. I think she moved too fast with Clarence. She, you got to think of it like this. Her and Chris, I said Chris. <laughs> her and 
Chris had their own place in Texas. And, yeah, that's another thing, because baby CJ's in the middle of this, but go ahead. Mm -hmm. We're going to get to him in a second. Her and Chris had their own place. She never got her own place. She just moved straight to Clarence. Or she was living with her mom, and then I don't know what was happening, but she never oh, yeah. got her own place. The like, first was, video they ever made, guarantee she didn't go back. She <laughs> was supposed to get her own place, and she didn't. Don't you remember that, though? What? The first video they ever made. She was, like, with him. After that first video, she never left New York, I feel like. Yeah, she never Everybody like after she that, never it was the same background. She was always with him. He was always in her videos. She was in his. And, like, she never went back home. She said she was supposed to get a place and stuff. And this is when she was still claiming they weren't dating, even though... We all they know. Were. They took so long to come out with that. They should have just came out. We all knew about it already. I swear. But I think she moved too fast. And then on top of that, like, her career is starting to take off in music. So I think, like, a lot of things is just happening. And just because her and Clarence was already talking, she's going to take them along and ride with her, which is fine. But I don't know how long they're going to last. Because now she's pregnant. And they wasn't even together that long. Mm -hmm. And they really don't even have that much time to focus a lot on the relationship. She can't even take care of baby CJ. Though. Like, not saying she can't, but she her don't time. have CJ all the time. Mm -mm. CJ is with Chris, I feel like, more. I think so, too. Um, I don't know what CJ does when he's with her, but, like, I don't know. I feel like I never seen CJ interact with another kid, so I wonder how I wonder how CJ is gonna react to having an actual sibling. But then at the same time, I'm gonna feel bad because what if he gets more attention, or like CJ's not she, gonna be able to be there all the time. Well, and ha yeah. like put yourself in CJ's shoes. Most kids, or most of the time, in situations, they'll stay with the mom primarily, and then you know go back with the dad, but. They're He's switching almost, off. Yeah, they're switching off almost 50-50. And then you have to think, when he goes to school, who is he going to be with primarily to go to school? Because he needs to be in one place to go to school, unless he got homeschooled or something. But shouldn't he have been starting school? How old is he? I don't know. He's eight? three. She said eight. <laughs> He's tall to be. He's tall. That's probably why. He's old. <laughs> but this is kind of watered down now. I might as well just stick to this. What you dipped out in that? You're a fell in it. Mm -hmm. Oh. Um. If my That's mom cool. was doing better than my dad, because I think Queen's definitely doing better than Chris. She getting money. She going on tour. She doing this. She doing that. Oh, yeah. Because if y'all seen the there, video. What was it? When Clarence um, reacted to Patty. Reacting to <laughs> Chris's. Uh, what is Wait, it called? Wait, we got to go back to that. Huh? What was it called? The challenge? The right back challenge. <laughs> was it right back? I uh -huh. And he was like, was talking about Clarence and Chris. I met Clarence and Queen. And when Clarence reacted, everything he was saying was true. Like, not saying nobody really cares about Chris no more, but who really watches him? Like, who is really interested? He got a bad name now. That's all it is, don't you think? Mm-hmm. Let's break it down like this. For those of y'all who don't know, Chris and Queen, how can you say it to them? Chris and Queen broke up. Chris got with Parker. Parker and Chris broke up. They try to say Chris hit her. I don't know that whole story. Me either. But then Chris goes and makes a right back challenge. But instead of talking about Parker, he's he talking, talking about, about Queen. Queen. So they were like, how do you skip an ex? Like, you can't just talk about Talk Queen, about he want to get what back happened with to her. Parker. Everybody's wondering about yeah. Parker. Which is true because, like, we are wondering. <laughs> like, he ain't telling us nothing. He ain't saying nothing. But he did upload a video, what, yesterday? He said the truth about me and Parker, and he's trying to say that she was basically, like, beating on him, and he was, like, trying to hold her back. He tried to say she threw a champagne bottle at him and baby CJ. And, like, all, like not even just one, but, like, that and what else? Like, a, bottle. a wine bottle, like, and so... It was hitting her, I mean, hitting him, like... But he, he said, never said what he did. He never... He, all he said was he said it he was, was so holding her. Yeah, but he never said, like, how she got the black eye. Like, she ain't gonna get that from holding her. Like, he didn't really explain anything. He so. never said nothing. Still kind of iffy. We need her mm -hmm. to speak out about it, but I don't think she is. Mm -mm. I'm so getting cool. Me too. Mm. Mm. 
so to basically wrap that up, would I make a couple's channel? Mm-mm. Mm they say no. Probably not, but I have thought about it. And okay. I, I feel like I'm responsible I would, to handle it. If it was like, we'd have to be together already for a while. Mm -hmm. We can't start and be like, oh, hey, guys, we've been together for nine months, and this is our YouTube channel. And then expect the YouTube channel to go for like, oh, we're together three years now. We would already have to be together for a while. And it would have to be a side thing that's fun. A lot of these couples, they... That's their career together. Yeah, that's their career And it's like, together. that's when you messed up. <laughs> because then you gotta think of it like... I don't know. Damo was already social media famous. Then Chrissy came along. Now they're broken up. Oops. Chrissy was handed that opportunity through Damo. But now Chrissy has to continue her career as a YouTuber because this whole time she was with Damo, she wasn't working. But like, like, they weren't doing nothing. You also have to think a lot of people who have, who are in couples, I might say besides DK4L, have their own channel. Like True. Damo and Chrissy, they have, okay, Chrissy has a channel, so does Damo. Damien Bianca. She must Damien. have made that channel knowing. Cause she's Chrissy? Per, yeah, cause she didn't make that her own channel from the beginning. Because mm -mm, she don't got that many videos either. She don't. So maybe they're going said, through something. Uh, Dierra and Kim might be the only ones who don't got their own channel. They don't have their own channel. That's just it. Oh, Gold Juice too. Do they have do they, a own I don't think. No, she does. Oh, wait. She has her she own. She has her own, own channel. He doesn't, I don't think. Because I feel like when you make your own channel, it's like, because when y'all break up, y'all still have a, something to rely on. Mm hmm But like dk 4 if they break up, that's between them too. Like, they don't really, I don't know. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Put in the comments what you think. Mm-hmm. If y'all know what we're talking about. We was just talking about YouTubers the whole time, so I guess if you don't really watch YouTube, you wouldn't know, but... Y'all yeah, should go look at some of the videos, like the Chris you and should Parker. Watch. Okay, uh, Kaylin and Kyra. We gotta put that you in gotta, the description. We gonna put these in the description All box. Because it's some interesting information. Mm -hmm. yeah, it is. Think, is there anything else? Um... I don't think there's nothing else, but our video is getting long, so um, we just want to say thank you if you have subscribed to the channel already. Yes. Most of y'all, we know, we go to school with y'all. Y'all are the people that we really love and or appreciate. Or families, friends. Yeah, we appreciate y'all We don't really know if we have followers like that are random. Like, do we know? I mean, subscribers. I don't know. I don't know either. I, I feel like they're all our friends. Yeah, I feel family. like it. Um, y'all should definitely comment so we know who actually watches. Even if you watch or the share beginning. the video so other people can see if you enjoyed it. Yeah, but thanks for watching. If you enjoyed us doing a mukbang, comment below. We'll do it again. Um, and if you want us to do it, you should tell us what we should eat next. Yeah, you should tell us what like, we should eat next. Cause I don't know. We just thought fries and wings and chicken and stuff would be good. Um, even though I'm full now. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna say. Oh, if not, comment other video ideas that you would want us to see. Yeah, because um, we need ideas. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Um, like it, share it, subscribe, comment. What else? <laughs> I guess that's all you can do with a video. Turn the post notifications oh, on. Oh, yeah. Because, you know, Yo, if you do that, you're real. <laughs> I'm about to do that. You're real. I don't even have... I don't even have that on for the YouTubers I actually watch. Me so. either. <laughs> but if you do that for our videos, you're actually, a real one and you're gonna get a shout out. You really gonna get a shout a out. Shout out. out. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Psych. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> we got that many uh subscribers yeah. for a shout out. <clears throat> you're gonna be the only one to see it, so but um <laughs> i think that's it yeah that's it so we'll see y'all in the next youtube video ow dang <laughs> we'll see y'all in the next youtube video bye bye